Are you getting tired of seeing this sign before you even get a chance to get in and take a look at the house? Well, if that's the case, then first of all, you're not alone. But second of all, I do actually have some pretty good news for you. And that's that the GTA real estate market is finally becoming a little bit easier to navigate. Now, when we look at the numbers, I do wanna preface this by saying any month compared to April, 2020, is gonna look a little bit shocking. It is gonna look a little bit skewed. And that's because April 2020 was the first full month of COVID related uh, real estate data, as I'll call it. So any month compared to last this time last year is going to look a little bit scary. But what I actually wanna focus on a little bit more is what I'm seeing in the market currently. And if we look at the numbers here, almost 2000 new listings in the Halton region, that's an excellent number, uh, 1400 sales. But the key piece of insight I wanna pick out of this is that there's been more new listings than there has been sales. And that means that inventory levels are finally starting to replenish a little bit. Now make no mistake, it is still very much a seller's market. There's still less than, an, less than one month of inventory in the market, meaning you do have to get your pre-approval done beforehand. You do have to do your home inspection beforehand, if applicable. However, you might actually get a chance to get in and take a look at the house before this sign goes up on the lawn which is huge for a lot of purchasers right now. Um, in practice, what this means is instead of seeing 25 or 30 offers on a home, I'm more commonly seeing three to five offers on a home right now, which is great news and this is probably the break you've been looking for if you are a purchaser who's been looking on the, or actively searching on the market for the past two to four months. On the flip side, if you are looking to sell your house right now, make no mistake, it is still very much so a seller's market, the only difference being there's a little bit more competition for you on the market right now than if you had of, or if you would have listed your home in February or March. Hope you guys found this insightful. Hope you found it helpful and I will see you next time.